This question comes from Pagan.Culture, which is, how do you make a maypole? Well, traditionally, maypoles used to be made out of very skinny, tall sapling trees or trees. But in today's modern world, um, it's easier to get a wooden dowel. So our coven actually, back in 1993, purchased a nine foot tall, a little thicker than a one inch dowel that's very sturdy. And what we do is we dig a hole and we put at least a foot or two foot of that into the ground. So it's not a tall maypole, but it does the job. And then we have a ring that we put on top of that. And as the ribbons are woven together, the ring slowly goes down until the end when it hits the earth. So the whole symbology behind a maypole is the masculine, represented by the phallic symbol of the pole, joining with Mother Earth, which is the hole that you dig in the ground. Everybody that's attending is picking a ribbon of the color that represents the magic that they would like to draw into their life in the next year. You know, like green is for money and growth and red is for passion or healing of the blood. Blue is for tranquility. You get the idea. Purple for spirituality. And everybody attaches their ribbon at the top of the pole. In the beginning, we tied them around the pole and hit knots. But now, after dancing this same maypole since 1993, as you can imagine, there's layer upon a layer upon layer. That maypole, where the ribbons are, is now over six inches around. It's pretty thick and it's still working great. So we tie on to the previous ribbons that are there. And um, the way you dance the maypole is I count everybody off A, B, A, B, A, B, A, B, all the way around the circle. And you want to try to have an even number of people. I always say A's turn left, B's turn right, and everybody's moving in an opposite direction. And then I also say A's go over first, B's go under first. And what happens is as the people move by each other, they're weaving the ribbons together and it creates this nice woven colorful pattern on the maypole as you dance it. We also have a chant that we chant and I'm gonna show you our maypole and teach you that chant next week. So follow me, you're gonna love it.